basketball game scheduled for Covcath and neighboring Holmes High School has been postponed. Nine on your side's Allie Kramer joins us from outside the Diocese of Covington with more on this decision. Allie? And Julie, the basketball game was postponed and uh, canceled for this evening, but not all events are being canceled because Holmes High School actually hosted uh, Covington Catholic High School's wrestling team and several other high schools in a meet just last night uh, on a, their Facebook page. That post that they made says that everyone was a bit on edge. Uh, there was concern of how the Covcath team would be received. It goes on to say that there was actually warmth and kindness and no issues, but we're told the basketball game, which would of course draw a much larger crowd tonight is canceled. The news came in a post on the Holmes High School website saying in part quote with passions running high relating to the incident in Washington DC this past weekend, officials from both schools agreed that it would be best to postpone the game. Now the video of that incident of course went viral when Cubcat student Nicholas Sandman was filmed wearing a Make America Great Again hat, initially appearing to stare down Native American activist Nathan Phillips. But longer videos later came out showing Phillips inserting himself between those students and members of the Black Hebrew Israelites who were hurling racial and homophobic slurs at some of those students. Now again, we were just outside Covington Catholic High School a bit ago, and Park Hills Police are still blocking both entrances to that high school. We expect security to remain throughout the entire school day today. Reporting live this morning in Covington, Allie Kramer, 9 on your side.